I was born in uh, Costa Rica. Started playing when I was, um, I believe, six years old. My parents enrolled me in uh, Universidad de Costa Rica. Started there. It was basically like the academy. And then from there, uh, I moved to, to Maryland when I was 10 years old with my whole family. We moved out there. Played for DC United Youth, um, youth System as well. And uh, went on to play college at University of Maryland. Played there for 2007, 2008. And we won a national championship. I won a um, ACC title as well. After my sophomore season, when we won um, both those championships, I went on to, to D I got drafted by DC United, six overall pick. And it was a dream come true for me, I'm playing at home. Basically, um, you know, I was the, the kid that was from, from Maryland that made it to DC United, which was, which was awesome. And uh, I was able to stay close to, to home and have my family and, and friends come out to the games. Um, and I was there for two years, and then I got traded to Portland. And I stayed there for five years and ended up winning the MLS championship in 2015. I was excited. It was a great honor to, to hear that uh, the team was interested in me, that uh, Patrick um, thought very highly of me, and um, I know some of the, I knew some of the players beforehand, um, uh, Matarita and uh, and Ethan, and uh, also um, the goalkeeper coach, Rob. He was my coach at Maryland, so we had that connection. And then when I heard that they had interest in me, it was it just seemed like the perfect situation at the time. And knowing that this is a, a very professional club here in the league. It only made things better. Um, it made things easier for me to make the decision to come here. I reached out to Matt uh, when there was there, there was interest in, in me coming here, and I had a bunch of questions for him. And you know he was he was excited that that I, that this opportunity had presented itself um, because we're, we're close um, on the national team and and we connect well. So um, it was definitely a plus <clears throat> for me and. Then, it was a plus for him to to be able to to have me here as well. So we're looking forward to, to making some good memories here. I just see that it's uh, it seems like a like a family here, which is which is very important. Um, you know, you can only accomplish greatness with uh, with a close group. If you feel close to the people around you, um, not just the players, but everyone around the club, it makes it uh, it makes it easier and. and it makes it easier in that process of, of looking for a championship and looking for trophies. And uh, the organization itself is very professional, which um, it motivates the players. They take care of the players and, and make, they make sure that everything is, is right so the players can perform on the field. And that's what I've noticed from my first couple of days here. The players themselves, are, they're all quality and the group is is solid. Right now it doesn't get better than that. Um, we have world-class players, world-class coaches. Those are guys that have accomplished a lot in their career. They know a lot. They, they bring a lot to the table and you know you're learning from from David, you're learning from Andrea, but you know you're learning from from a coach like Patrick and it just it all just seems right and it's you know we're going in the right direction and I'm I'm happy to be um, part of, of, of this right now he, you know he told me what he expects of me he told me that he saw very good qualities in me he knows that I bring um, a winning mentality to this team go it's a whole package that just seemed to be perfect at the time you know you get to be a part of New York City FC a team that's literally in one of the best cities in the world, if not the best city in the world. At this stage of my career, I couldn't really ask for anything more. I'm a left-sided player. I like to play out in the wing, get um, around the defenders, look for space, um, score goals, get crosses in. Um, also help out in the, in the defensive side of the of the ball, organized and like I said, hungry. What are your goals here in New York City? To win an MLS Cup. Um, that's 
That's what we're all looking for. That's the ultimate goal here, to win an uh, Open Cup, to win, to get into a uh, <clears throat> Champions League and, and be successful there as well. I mean, there's a lot of things that we want to do um, as a club, and we have the quality to, to get it done. I leave it all out there on the field, um, whether it's uh, offensively, whether it's defensively. I am covering a lot of ground, um, making plays, uh, whether it's breaking up plays, I give it my all every every single game and every single training session, and <clears throat> you know I bleed the colors that I, that I that I represent, and and right now I'm completely invested in, in New York City FC, so you know I'm just ready to get out there and uh, and put the work in. You know I'm grateful to be here. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna give it my all for sure, and. Uh, I'm looking forward to sharing great moments with them. Um, looking forward to, to lifting trophies with with the uh, with the supporters, and uh, it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be a good ride for us.